from Bilderboeing and um, well this is something I made uh, yesterday and today and so what is it what is it well it's my beloved foam again a box made out of foam um, at some point you're going to be sick and tired of me talking about this foam three wires sticking out here and right now it's not interface so I just have a switch over here so I can show you How about that? So it's just um, the material, I don't know what you call this. Um, we called it overheads when I went to school before we had PowerPoints. I just printed two, there, there, there's different versions. Questions. I just printed two and laid them doubled. You can actually see if you see the non-smoking sign here, you can see it's a bit off there by millimeter, whereas the seatbelt sign over here is just okay. So in here at the back, uh, a lot of LEDs and a, a divider here so that the, the light doesn't go from here to here. I'm going to interface with ProSim and install it in the, outside the cockpit. Hmm, neat, huh? Okay, so now I have the panel installed outside the cockpit and interface with ProSim. Um, if you interface with ProSim, you're not able to find this in the, the indicators tab. You need to go to the gates tab and there configure uh, the output card. If you don't use ProSim, I guess you can just hardwire it from your fasten seatbelt switch and no smoking switch to uh, to the panel over here. But now it is interfaced with ProSim, so I can turn the seatbelts on. And no smoking sign off. Seatbelts going off. And no smoking sign on. How about that? A pretty useless feature, but uh, on the other hand, a pretty cool feature to have outside your cockpit. I'm Peter from Billabung. You guys take care.